Yes. I got a jar of dirt. I got a jar of dirt. And guess what's inside it? Render for right, so welcome back to the channel, everyone. Um, if you've seen our previous videos, we did the big order and we got some uh, mature pairs. Um, we're going to do this video today, which is the Ephibibus unamatum. Unama unamatum. I can never say that properly. But this is mature male going into this enclosure, which is probably going to be a temporary enclosure for the minute because we didn't have any other tubs bigger because we used them for another one, which we'll see tomorrow. But it's got at least, I'd say about eight inches of substrate in these tubs. It's plenty enough, so it should be absolutely fine. Spring tails, um, loads of good substrate, nice hide as well for them. So we'll just remove that out. And we're doing this one in the bathroom purely because when you get adult species, certain ones, if you don't know them, if you haven't raised them, it's easier in case they're going to be skittish. But the reason we're doing this in here is if you watch a video after this one, is where we're getting one that's going to be a lot more feistier. So we just want to make sure we're being safe. And we've got a chicken cooking, so I want to get this done. Because <laughs> I'm so we're going to get this done. So we'll start off with the mature male and then we'll show the female and just get them rehoused. So I've got a catch cut ready. Do it. Move that out. You might want to just be careful because of um, they can climb under that. Mm -hmm. All right. So to move back. You can't rest on me. <laughs> Why not? Oh, he's a lot smaller than what I thought he was going to be. So this is going to be actually perfect for him. Can't really see him there. I know, you've zoomed in too much. Oh, my fingers are too small for your phone. Give you a close up there. Bam. It's weird how you can see the colours off camera, but because of the lights on them, it makes them darker on camera, but it's not. He's a lot paler, isn't he? Yeah, so let's go back up. Shall we just tap him and see if he wants to walk up in? Let's mm -hmm. see what sort of temperament he's got though. Playing dead. Yeah. <laughs> He's playing the dead. Right, I think what I'm gonna do is put him in. Yeah, put my hammer in, in it's fine. Can you see if I turn it this way? Oh, dude. Look at your home there. <laughs> Look at the colour. Wow. It's almost, it's almost that's a mature male, but that's a lot smaller. Okay, no, no, look there, that's fine. That's beautiful, isn't it? And that's the emerald skeleton, but that's mature male, so look, a little bit smaller than what I thought, but in some species you get larger males, you get smaller males, depending on how much they're fed, so absolutely beautiful though, but we'll leave that one to start burrowing, and we'll see if he'll love doing it. His legs are all bunched up. Yeah, yeah, we'll do because he's out, and because it's got light on. Same setup again. Let's get this one smashed out. Ready? Yup. Didn't need catch cut for that one. Okay, so female. See what we're working with here. Bit more colour on her. Fat legs. 
Oh, look at the colour of her butt. See, it doesn't show up on the camera, does it? Dark in here, but it's like, it's like ruby red. No, it's not on the... They're actually quite small, aren't they? Hmm. And they actually freeze, don't they? Rock they, solid. You know, they bunch their legs right up as well. He did the same. <laughs> Very good at playing dead. Oh. <laughs> She's coming to get you. So what makes them not strike back then? How I don't does know. It's just shipping and Just be on the safe side because I expect these can be very fast if they want to. Where are these from? I don't know, but I'll put it on the screen. Colour a little bit more now. Yeah, so they're basically both the same size then. So whether she's fully grown because she's basically the same size as a mature male, but I would have thought she would be a little bit bigger. So they did say there. Can you mind? Just fatten her up a bit. Yeah, will do. I'll give you some juicy worms. Can you mind? <laughs> she's like, I do not. There you go. Well, that was really chilled. There you go. <laughs> Didn't need to do that anywhere at all, did we? No, but they're both playing dead, aren't they? Yeah, very stubborn but beautiful colour. Come on. There we go. Opened up. Beautiful. You get a good shot? Yeah. Hey, sweet pea. So there we have it, the two of these, the Emerald Skeleton. So um, they are like the uh, Blue Fang as well, but obviously just a different variation. So they don't have the blue Clarissa Ray. But um, you can still see on the legs there, the yellow coloration going across the legs. But I love the orange, like orangutan sort of color mm -hmm. abdomen and then the striped body. But they're a little bit smaller, but the other one's mature. And this one's um, was sold as an adult female. So I do a bit more research on this, feed them up and then see if we can get them pairing, but they are absolutely beautiful. But I'm not going to do any pairing at all with her until she's settled, burrowed in a hole, um, made it her own, then we'll do it. So uh, Big fetch is the meal. Yes, yeah, so I think that's good. So thanks very much for watching on this video, guys, and we will see you on the next one. See you.